doesn't even hurt. Very Piece good. of cake, thank you. Dr. Dahlia Wax receiving her first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine Saturday. You get to choose which arm you use. So since I'm right-handed, I chose the left. And then there was a 15-minute observation period. As the COVID-19 vaccine rollout continues to play out across the nation, we're still seeing infections. In Massachusetts, Congressman Stephen Lynch tested positive for the coronavirus after receiving the second dose of the Pfizer vaccine. And there's an explanation of how that could happen. It still takes a few weeks, even after your second shot, to have the 95% immunity. According to the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, if someone tests positive within a few weeks of receiving the second dose, it may be because the vaccine hasn't fully kicked in yet. Dr. Wax says new variants of the virus, like those from the U.K. and South Africa, could hinder vaccine efforts. To America, we don't know how extensive it is, and we do know that the Pfizer and Moderna vaccine were made for the earlier variants. The Southern Nevada Health District says second doses of the vaccine are recommended three to four weeks after the first dose, depending on the vaccine. Dr. Wax says time is of the essence. So that process takes a few weeks, which is why whatever I did now doesn't really, won't really give me any protection for at least a few weeks. And if all goes well, Dr. Dahlia will be receiving that second shot within the coming weeks. Now, if you're sitting at home wondering, when will your chance be to get the vaccine? Well, we have a breakdown of Nevada's lane system when it comes to getting that vaccine. It's on our website right now. Just head over to KTNV.com. Reporting at the Southern Nevada Health District tonight, I'm Austin Carter, 13 Action News.